At first glance, this place does look a little bit like a crime scene, but this is in fact the coolest place I've ever been to in Tokyo. My Japanese partner and I are just tourists here in Tokyo, but luckily we have a local friend who has great taste in cafes and bars to take us around. This is Sangen Jaya. This is Sangen Jaya, or Sancha for short. If you've ever visited Tokyo, you might be familiar with places like Shinjuku, Shibuya, and Harajuku. But there are so many more cool places in this huge city of 50 million people. And just on the outskirts of Shibuya, you'll find one of Tokyo's greatest hidden gems. On Sundays, the main road here is closed to oncoming traffic, making a pleasant family-friendly vibe. But if you creep into the back streets, you'll find this awesome grungy vibe, home to countless hole-in-the-wall establishments that start to open up as the sun goes down. And here we are back at the scene of the crime. It looks just as dodgy from the outside as it does from the inside. The place we're going to here is called A Bridge. It is a rooftop cafe slash bar with an insane view of the surrounding Tokyo skyline. Mm. Fun fact, this building is called the Carrot Building. Not sure why though. These alleyways here in Sangenja are called Sankakuchitai. But don't be fooled by their seemingly deserted, dingy exterior. Even though it is a Sunday night, we struggled to find an izakaya that wasn't full. This is what I love so much about Tokyo. Amid all these extreme efforts to keep the city pristine and presentable, it is these older streets with character that the locals flock to. Eventually, we found this izakaya called Rabada. The best thing about traveling Japan with a native is that I just sit back and let them pick all the food. And obviously, it never fails to impress. This is minced meat eaten in raw capsicum. <laughs> totally novel idea to me, but delicious. We had some delicious char grilled chicken and this sauteed tofu and pork. And then some more fish. <laughs> they also barbecued some onion and baby corn for us. Everything was super tasty, 10 out of 10. I wish we'd have more time to explore the hidden alleyways. But I know next time I'm in Tokyo, I'll definitely be back here hunting izakayas among these old Tokyo streets. Thanks so much for watching. I hope this motivates you to explore somewhere a little different in Tokyo. Look forward to seeing you in our next video. Bye! Oh my god, look at what he's making. Oh my god! Tastes just like the one we had.